the level which is actually covered by the you know diaphragm body and uh, like you see the diaphragm is a muscular and delicious structure it is actually covering the liver superiorly okay so this is the liver and it, it has to look like it's the right look of the liver this is the left look of the liver and you know the liver is actually protected anteriorly and posteriorly by the ribs and the ribs which are related to the liver is uh, you know the 7th 8th 9th 10th and 11th rib and remember the diaphragm actually separates the liver from the pleura if you say then the rib relation should be the 10th rib and uh, if we say that diaphragm is separating the liver from the you know the lungs then the rib relation should be uh, Okay. Actually, and remember, the right lobe of the liver is associated with the right hypochondrium and along with that, the inferior border of the right lobe of the liver is also related in the right lumbar region, like this portion, and the left lobe of the liver actually lies in the epigastrium. Along with that, some part of the left lobe actually lies in the left hypochondrium. Okay. Okay, and uh, now this is the gallbladder, as we all know, like this is the gallbladder. Let me remove or let, let me extract this liver from this body. Remember, this is the IVC, okay, the inferior vena cable, which is actually running in the inferior vena cable roof in this liver only. Like we are cutting this liver, okay, so we are actually cutting the C. The IVC is cut. This is the peritoneum pore which we are actually removing, right? covering the liver but except uh, the, you know, the liver is not actually completely covered by the peritoneum there is one area called the bare area of liver which is actually where actually the peritoneum is absent okay remember this is the IVC only right Over it and we will meet afterward and we will discuss more over the liver. Okay.